You could call them the hidden stars of Indian cinema because while their faces aren't often on screen, their voices can make or break a movie. I'm talking about playback singers, and Benny Dahl and Shalmali Kolgade are among the regular chart toppers. They performed live in concert in Durban recently, and Kajal had an all areas access. When Hrithik Roshan's Rajveer charmed Katrina Kaif's Haleen in the title track from Bang Bang, the voice you heard definitely wasn't his, because Benny Dayal was doing the crooning. Similarly, Shalmali Kolgade put the words on the lips of Deepika Padukone in Balam Pichkari from Ye Jivani He Divani. Gurmeet Chaudhary, on the other hand, isn't a singer, but he is one of Bollywood's hottest dancers. So when this powerhouse Triple Bull performed in Durban recently, they filled the city's biggest indoor venue. Today, Bollywood has not only reached the Indian diaspora, but people of all cultures and backgrounds. Music can take a lot of the credit because it truly is a universal language. Today, we attend the Indian Party of the Year right here in Durban with artists who are shaking up the charts and the silver screen. Backing bands and lighting plans are integral to the show, but they represent just a tiny part of the challenge faced by Hermit Ardeo to bring the three stars to South Africa. The Bollywood craze seems to be undying. What, in your opinion, makes it so attractive? Colour dance, fantasy and everything else around it. It's just a craze. Now how did you go about choosing artists for tonight's show? I looked at Benny Dayal and Charmini being chartbusters and they have got a lot of songs together so that's why I've chose that duo and also Gurmeet Choudhury with his fan following in South Africa as Yash, that's why I chose him. Fans from across the country flocked to the show and as they kept on streaming in the venue was packed to capacity by the time Benny stepped onto the stage. Thanks to his exceptional voice and instrumental skills, Benny Dayal has always been at the forefront of innovation of the Indian music industry. And he was also groomed by Academy Award winner A.R. Rahman. Benny, how does it feel returning to a place where you are much loved? I've always learned one thing that music is something that brings people together. And uh, it has always been my dream to travel all around the world and you know play the music that I've created and you know entertain people with whatever I can do. So uh, it's a blessing. Benny, your success has been growing and growing. Take us back to the days of when you were first dreaming of becoming a singer. Uh, I was 13. <laughs> I was in school. I was in Abu Dhabi. And uh, since then, you know, I've been wanting to sing and be an entertainer. So uh, it's come through. It's 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 really hard. And uh, it was a it was a crazy journey. And then I met Mr. Rahman and uh, started my career in 2008. And since then, it's been no looking back. <laughs> You are a very successful artist in a competitive industry. What's your secret? The point is to just be yourself. Uh, you have to be Benny Dayal because everyone else is taken. So uh, just being myself the way I am, the way I've, I was brought up and the way I choose to be and the, way, the things that I love, that's what makes me, so it's all me in a platter. Benny, do you have a message for our South African viewers at home? I just want to say I love you and uh, thank you for listening to all the songs and um, all that you've listened to and all that you've loved has brought me here to perform again and again and uh, thank you very much. Best known in South Africa as the character Yash Sindhya in the popular TV show Punar Vivya, Gurmeet Chaudhary has also been a highly successful contestant 
in India's top dance reality shows. Gurmeet, welcome back to South Africa and welcome to Mela. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Now, you have been to South Africa many times. I think you should live here some parts of the year. What do you well, think? I love South Africa, seriously. I mean, it's like my fourth year I'm coming here and back to back I'm, I'm doing my shows over here. So I'm very lucky that uh, South Africa, they, they love me. Now, you have um, won reality shows, dance competitions, you've been in film, um, on television. What has the journey been like for you? So, you see, uh, for me, uh, I believe in uh, hard work, you know, and uh, uh, so I just give my 200%, uh, you know, if I'm dancing, I just give my 200%, if I'm acting, I just give my 200%. So, for me, the journey is, uh, was superb and uh, I do believe in hard work and uh, my mantra is never give up. Singer Shalmali Kolgado made her breakthrough with Parishan from Ishak Zade and she's gone on to achieve soundtrack hits in Cocktail. Race 2, ABCD2 and of course, Ye Jawani Hai Diwani. I never imagined myself singing Hindi songs. I always sang English music growing up. In college I, I was with bands and I used to sing in clubs and bars and do the odd three hour singing in cafes when no one's listening to you. I happened to send my vocal demos, which were in English, to Amit Trivedi, uh, music director Amit Trivedi, who liked me and my singing and called me to a studio and made me sing uh, dummy lines for a Bollywood song, which would be the first time I ever sang a Hindi song at all. <laughs> and Parishan was that song and it did well and I'm here now because of that one song. <laughs> Shalmali is refreshingly humble about her star status. I didn't even know until I got here how much love there was in South Africa for me. So thank you for that. And do keep listening and do keep uh, sending suggestions, critiques. I'm always open to critiques because I want to do better for you and for myself. So I hope I come back and I hope I can entertain you for a really long time. <laughs> The show was absolutely, insanely incredible. Benny Vial is my favorite. He's just got this presence on stage. You know, it's all about showmanship with him. He moves his hands a lot. He's dancing around a lot. He's interacting with the crowd a lot. He was certainly the best. Uh, he totally rocked the audience and everyone just literally got up uh, off their chair uh, and enjoyed themselves dancing the night away. Uh, the show as a whole was absolutely fantastic. The vibrance, the energy was amazing. The crowd was absolutely phenomenal. Uh, Benny Dial is a powerhouse performer. Shalmali just blows the audience away and she has this thing about herself where she just belongs in Broadway. She's like the ultimate star, singer, dancer, entertainer. What a night it's been. Gurmeet, Shalmali and Benny Dial got the audience dancing and singing to their Tunes. I have no doubt that Bollywood still holds a very special place in the hearts of South Africans.